If somebody's going to be the change maker in a practice and they want to, uh, how, how can they get started and how can they then create the change, not only for themselves, but across the practice? For what? Across the practice. Well, um, first of all, I always tell them if you yourself are not interested in this thing of communicating with your patients, have somebody in the team that does. It's very important. Uh, if you want to be the game changer, you can do it. I mean, you can attend um, a workshop and then try to translate that to your patients. And word travels fast. Yes. So if you start making a change with your own patients and other health professionals start, oh, wow, so how did you do that? Or you discover something about a patient that's been there for years and all of a sudden you discover something that you should have known years back but it never really popped out in a conversation for some reason yeah. yes and then everybody gets interested in wow so how did you how did you get that piece of information how did it happen that you said that or that she said that and this is like giving a bait to the rest of the team and putting them in this game. <laughs> yeah, yeah. If somebody's going to be the change maker in a practice and they want to, uh, how, how can they get started? And how can they then create the change, not only for themselves, but across the practice? For what? Across the practice. Well, um, first of all, I always tell them if you yourself are not interested in this thing of communicating with your patients, have somebody in the team that does. It's very important. Uh, if you want to be 